we as parents need to stop and make sure that our kiddos are safe, right? We're going to have the babysitter set up, but we always do what we can to make sure our kids are protected. And the best way to do that is to be proactive. And that's why we have this fantastic woman here. This is Amitis Prarion. She is the owner of the Studio Martial Arts and Fitness Center. And she's going to show us a child anti-abduction workshop that she's going to be holding. But today you're giving everybody a taste of what they can expect when they attend. You happen to be a seventh degree black belt. You know what you're doing. And so do these amazing kiddos. Who did you bring today? Well, let me introduce them to you. These are my little mini martial artists. If you guys would stand up for me, please. Yes, ma'am? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. All right. This little one is Miss Sabine. Show them what you got, Sabine. Go ahead, stretch kick. Axe kick. Nice. Yeah. What? Yeah. Good. This is Mr. Benny. Front kick. Front kick. Punch, punch. Yeah. Nice. Say, yeah. Yeah. All right. This is Mr. Caius. Go get it. Get up. Nice. Yeah. And thank you, sir. And this is Mr. Ricky. Go, round kick. Tornado. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, there Why didn't you cut some air on that one? Okay, so Amatis, why did you find it important to have an anti child abduction workshop? Well, I honestly don't think there's anything more important than keeping our kids safe. Mm -hmm. And, um, I'm an auntie of five nieces and nephews, and I take it very serious. And at the Studio of Martial Arts and Fitness, we are very community-based, so this is a community service that I'd like to provide to keep all the kids in my community extremely safe. And as a mother, I want to say thank you, and I absolutely love this. So let's show our viewers. We just saw some of the skills these kids have simply by attending the studio, but what are some things that you're going to be teaching them at this workshop? Surprisingly, they're not going to use any of those skills. They're going to use different skills. They're going to use their vocal skills and their uh, brain to get themselves out of situations. And so we talk about this in our uh, program, and that uh, we teach the kids scenario specific, uh, specific activities. And so, for example, do um, you want me to show you some stuff? Absolutely. Please do. So, yes. So, uh, for kids' safety, uh, Ms. Sabine, uh, what would you do if you got lost, let's say, at the store, at the mall, um, in the woods, at Disneyland? What are you taught to do? And? And sit. So, this allows the parents or security to come find the child instead of the uh, child going wandering. all over the day, wandering, and then getting further lost and taking longer to be yes. rescued. Stay where you're at and wait for somebody to find you. You got it. Yes. Oh, okay. well, what's another one? Okay, next one, Miss Benny. Uh, Mr. Benny is going to demonstrate in the event someone tries to lure him. That means they're going to tell him uh, maybe in his ear a threat. And he knows that the threat's a lie because we've trained him to know it's a lie. And maybe they say, I'm going to hurt your mommy if you don't come with me. Mm -hmm. And then this is what Benny's going to do. You're not my mommy! Louder. Good job. You're not my mommy! Very good, sir. Very nice. Very good. Okay, next. Mr. Kais is going to demonstrate in the event that that person is not going to let go of them and they're going to continue to take them and drag them. Mm -hmm. This is what uh, Kais has been taught to do. Okay. So, you're going to come with me or I'm going to hurt your mommy. You're not my daddy! You're <laughs> not my mommy! Okay. Nice. So, what does that lo look like? Like, a, a that's little, not normal. No, no. So, someone's going to yeah. say, what is happening here? And they're going to come to his rescue. Mm -hmm. It's an adult dragging a child across the floor. That's not normal, and we're trying to draw attention. Yes, yes, absolutely. And then Mr. Ricky is going to demonstrate in the event he actually gets picked up and is being taken away. And what is he going to do? Not, he's screaming and yelling, and he's going to bite and scratch a lot. Okay? All right. Thanks for pretending, buddy. Yes, I know. He's about ready to take a chunk right out of your wrist right there. Yes. So obviously very well trained. They know what to anticipate and what to do in the event of the very unfortunate. But that's have to do as parents is make sure that we prepare our children for uh, you know the potential of something happening wonderful I'm so glad you're having this workshop where can our viewers go so they can attend and be a part of this they can go to our website train at the studio.com or just call us at 258 kick a very easy phone number to remember and then they can register for this on Saturday May 20th at 3 to 5 and we strategically placed it after you know baseball soccer whatever the kids are doing and before parents want to go enjoy their evening so that there's really no excuse and i feel like every parent should take this course at least one time um to keep their kids safe absolutely i'm just thank you so much thank you so much always for having always us. love what you're doing and kiddos good job so thank you're you awesome